beautiful people, if you don't know who I am, my name is Sharon. Contrary to the popular belief of my name scrolling past your newsfeed, it's Sharon, not Sharon. Hello, how are you? Good morning to you. Good morning to you. We are making the good copy. Good morning, David. Coming in strong from heart. I love it. Yes, good morning. I don't know what's going on here. It's looking a little janky and crooked. There we go. It's not crooked now. Okay. Yay! Okay, let's make the good copy. What are we making? Skinny Brew. Skinny Brew is an amazing, quick, instant copy that keeps you full and focused with nootropics. It burns your fat, increases your metabolism, it gets your body out of stress, ridiculousness. It's so, so awesome. So quick and easy to make. It's 225 milligrams of caffeine. That's why I absolutely love it. And I'm going to froth it with my frother. Yes. Frothing with my frother. Oh my goodness. Oh, it's, I can actually smell it this morning. Good morning, sis. How are you? Thanks for joining. Okay, so this is what we're doing. I am been really just super bougie about this. Hey, Andrea, how are you? So I've been super, super bougie about this, but I've been really kind of just enjoying like my, um, my cream on the side and just like frothing it up and then adding it to my coffee. I don't know what's up with that, but I, I just like it. Hey, Brianna, how are you? Hey, Sierra, hey, Beth. Okay, I got some good information for y'all because I, I I just have this feeling out there that people are not losing the way they want to, and I just want to help you out today. I really want to help you out. Good morning to you. Yes, I love you too, boo. Thanks for joining. Okay, so here we go. I got my cream in here. I'm just going to put it on top of my coffee. It'd be like my own barista. Oh, so delicious. Okay, here we go. All right, I got notes this morning, so we're going to be kind of quick. All right. So, number one reasoning why you probably aren't losing any weight. Yay! That's how you do it to my... Do, you do too? Oh my goodness! Yes, I'm, am I starting trends? Probably starting trends. Okay, number one the reason why you're not losing weight is because your carb intake is too much. Like, you're saying that you don't want any carbs or any sugar, but you're steady, like, on the carbs. Like, just, yeah. When you are talking about, like, wanting to lose weight, like, your carbohydrates need to be at, like, 25 gram, 25 to 30 grams per day. You don't need not, you know what I'm saying? Like you don't need to be having more than that because if you have more than that, then you're not going to be in fat burning mode. And we want to be in fat burning mode all the time because we want to be losing weight, right? Okay. So the next reason why you're probably not losing weight, I hope you have your pens and papers because this is really good information. Okay. And I'm giving you great content. You better have your pens and paper. Okay. Number two, you need to fast. You're, you're probably not giving your body enough rest. So let's just say like you're eating like all hours of the day, right? Okay. And you're not giving your body enough breathing room in the evening time to actually digest the food properly and reset itself. So it's not even getting enough time between meals. So you need to actually fast. Like a good fast, a good one to go start with is like a 12 hour fast. So you're just mostly you're sleeping. Okay. And then you like wait a couple hours and then you have like, you know, your breakfast. That's why it's called breakfast because you're breaking your fast, right? Okay. All right. I thought you guys knew, right? Okay. Number three, stress levels are too high. Your stress levels are too high. Your Everything is happening all at once. Oh my gosh, I can't take it. I need to just chill, but you can't lose any weight because your cortisol, like the, 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 the chemical cortisol is now just, just seeping into your, into your belly and you're not doing, you can't do anything about it because you're just in under stress. So you're going to maybe need like a good vitamin, like I carry a good confianza. I love our confianza. It's so awesome. It helps to block stress eating, helps to block all that weirdness. You do need it. It's amazing. Okay. So the next thing, everybody say hi to the peanut gallery. Hi, Jason. Hi, Jason. Okay. So the next thing is number 
four is exercise or lack thereof. So I actually found out that um, through my like studies and everything like that of me like losing weight and everything like that, that, if, that exercise only contributes to 15% of your overall weight loss. But when you are doing it, it actually does add up. You know what I'm saying? It actually adds up and it does help for good heart health and everything like that. So maybe you actually do need to like add in some exercise okay I know you say that you don't, don't need to do any exercise I know you say you're not trying to do any exercise but maybe you need to walk to your mailbox maybe you need to walk around your block maybe it's something sustainable like walking I'm not asking you to run amok or grab the weights or anything like that but maybe it's something sustainable like walking okay number five Oh my gosh, this is so big. This is just, this is so super huge because like I, when I get good sleep, I feel like I lose like a good pound and it's the truth, but you're probably not even getting good sleep. You're probably just napping. <laughs> you're probably just napping throughout your day, like you're in the evening time. So you're probably only getting like maybe four, maybe five hours of rest and everything. And you really actually do need like eight hours. If you're wanting to actually lose some weight, you actually do need six to eight hours of good rest, y'all. A good like mm, knockout rest, okay? So yeah, you might want to enjoy some of our sleepy tea. I'm just saying, like, sleepy tea is the bomb. Okay, number six. I got seven for you, and I got, and I'm going to get going here. Where are we at? Okay, I'm actually good on time. Woohoo! Yay! All right, if you're getting good content out of this, like, drop me some hearts or something. Let me know that I'm alive because I'm, like, I'm excited this morning, and I want to help y'all, like, really actually dispel, like, not being able to lose weight. So let me know if I'm hooking you up with all the good information. Give me some hearts. Okay, say, girl, yes, girl, tell me something. Tell me something. Okay, so I got two more, and then I'm going I'm to sip my coffee. I should probably sip it, huh? <laughs> okay, all right. Mmm, mmm. So good. I think I got some foam on my nose. Okay, all right. It's good information. Yes, girl. I know it's good because, like, I looked it up. <laughs> and I wrote it down. <laughs> Hallelujah. All right. Number six. Number six. The reason why you're probably not losing any weight, number six, is because your fat intake and your protein intake is a little off. It's a little off. Maybe you're not, maybe you're getting in too much fat. You know, like maybe like you're like, maybe you're adding in too much fat, you know, like, I mean, good. I'm not, I know fat, it takes fat to burn fat, but hear me out. Maybe you're adding in too much fat in, in certain foods. Do you know what I'm saying? Maybe it's less, maybe you need more protein. Maybe it's lack thereof. Maybe you need more of it. I'm not really sure. Maybe you got to figure that out. Okay. That's probably why you're not losing any weight. All right. Number seven. Number seven is the reasoning why I talk about it all the time. I talk about it all the time. Okay, so if, okay, I say this all the time, and if you've been watching me in any length of time, I say what? Weight loss and weight gain is make or break by what? Somebody drop it in the comments. So I say this all the time. Like, your weight loss can make or break you by what? What thing do I tell you that you need to focus on all the time in order to dispel weight loss at its core? Like, there's only one thing I say, I talk about all the time. One thing. I mean, yes, not quitting, all that, yes, all that good stuff, yes, but there's one thing I talk about all the time. Can somebody drop it in the comments? I know somebody's on here that has watched me all the time and be like, Sharon, I know the information. Nothing wrong with notes. Yes, boo. Okay, no, come on, y'all. Come on, there's five eyeballs. Wait, I say weight loss makes or break you by what? Hey, Joseph, thanks for joining. Thanks for joining. Thanks for joining. So I say weight loss makes or break you because y'all are too slow. I don't even know what's going on with y'all this morning. Like, I guess I have all the energy. That's why y'all need the coffee because y'all need the good energy too, okay? Just hooking you up. All right, so the last one is digestion. Your digestion is way off. It's super slow. You don't have the right bacteria in there. It's not doing what it needs to do. You know what I'm saying? You're just, turn that down, bro. Just turn it down a little bit. Thanks. Like, you're, like your digestion is super slow, so you're...
You're going to need to do a really good cleanse. You're going to need to make sure that you do a really good detox. You may need to get one of our cleanses. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Especially from me. Because what it's going to do is going to get out all the bad bacteria and put in all the good bacteria. That way you can actually lose. Because the reasoning why we are not actually able to lose weight or eat. And sometimes the reasoning why we're gaining weight is because our digestion is super off. And so we need to fix our digestion. How do we fix our digestion? Not simply just by like a cleanse. If you want to do something every day, like just to really rework all of this, like belly health, all of that. And it's not just for, it's not just for women. It's for men too. Men too. Because you men too have horrible digestion as well. That's the reason why your belly is so big. Y'all be talking, y'all, I know you men, I love y'all, but y'all don't like it when your bellies are big. So y'all may want to think about tackling digestion at its root. Maybe you need a cleanse. Maybe you need to do celery. I don't know what that may be. Because you can do, you can do crunches all you want to. You can do crunches all you want to, but it's not going to help you get that big old belly down. Do you know what I'm saying, guys? All right. I love y'all. Okay. So the first thing we talked about is carb intake. Maybe it's too much. Number two, we talked about maybe you need to fast. Maybe you're not giving your body enough like rest period within your eating, okay? Number three, stress. Your stress levels are way too high. You need to decrease the stress levels. Number four, even though exercise contributes to 15% of your overall weight loss, it actually does add up and maybe you need to actually add in some exercise, maybe some sustainable walking. Maybe you're walking to your mailbox. Maybe you're walking around your block. I don't know what that may be, but you need to do it. Okay, number five, you're not sleeping enough. You need to get some good rest. And I'm not talking about like maybe like one or two, maybe three, four hours. I'm talking about six to eight hours, sis. Six to eight hours of some really good like... Knock out sleep, okay? That's what's going to help you. All right. Number six, you're eating too much fat or too li much protein or too little. You need to figure out what your levels are so that you can actually be able to actually burn fat and, you know, lose weight, right? That's what you're going to need. Okay. Number seven, last one, is because you have horrible digestion and you need to get out the bad bacteria and put in the good bacteria. Yes, those are the reasonings why you're probably not losing weight. And I can tell you, I can tell you that all of these like reasons here, I can hook you up with. I have something within my product realm that I can help you out with so that you can actually dispel it and you can feel good and you can actually, you know, not feel all bloated and crap and all that stuff. So, when you need that, I'm here. I'm going to get it going because it is my time. It is going to be 6.30 here, um, Pacific Standard Time. And Jason's going to school. Jason has a good um, a school week. Mike has a good work week. You know, I'm going to have a good business week. It's going to be great. Everybody's going to be fantastic. I am feeling, can you believe it or not, I'm not feeling 100%. <laughs> Believe it or not, I'm not feeling 100%. But, you know, hey, we're here. Praise God. Hallelujah. All right, so if you guys need anything else, you all know where to find me. Have the best day of your life, and you need this coffee. Why? Because we're drinking a full pot. Duh. <laughs> okay, bye.